Hello, 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 and welcome to ITTV. Yes, boys and girls, it's math time. And as usual, we are going to start something new, which is length. Well, centimeters, meters, kilometers, that's what we're going to do. Now, boys and girls, before that, yes, the teaser from last lesson. Let's look at it and then the answer for you all. You have a bag with four candy bars in it. You promise to give each of your three friends a candy bar and you want one for yourself. How can you accomplish this and still have one candy bar left in the bag? So boys and girls, did you get the answer? Well, it's very simple. You have to give, well, I'm not going to tell you, but let's read it together. Take a candy bar for yourself and then take out two more and give them yes to your two friends. Give your third friend the bag with the third candy bar still in it. Or give each friend a candy bar and keep the candy bar in the bag for yourself. So, very simple, right? Yeah, I bet you would have thought, yeah, I need five candies to have even one in the left in the bag. But you see, you just needed to. Yes, take out the candy bar and pass the bag with the candy bar to one of your friends. Simple? Ha! Huh. Tricky, tricky, tricky. All right then. Now for today's lesson, which is length. Welcome back, boys and girls. Now, I want to share with you something very important or interesting about length. Well, have you heard about the Olympics? I'm sure you have, right? Even Malaysia has taken part in the Olympic Games. So, I'm sure you would have heard of the long jump or track events. Well, long jump is one of the track events that you have in the Olympics. And yes, there is a thing called Olympic World Records. So, do you know who holds the long jump world record? Yes, his name is Bob Beeman and he is an American citizen. In the last Olympic, okay, last Olympic Games, a guy from Panama, Mr. Irving, his name was, only jumped 8.34 meters and he was, yes, he was, what was he? Yes, the Olympic gold medalist. And Bob Beeman, well, he won in 1968 and he jumped as far as 8.9 meters. How far? 8.9 meters. So, he still holds the world record and Olympic record for the long jump. Huh? All of you out there, well, you have the chance or opportunity to beat him. All right? All right then, as I've mentioned, length, right? So, he jumped in length and that is 8.9 meters. Now, what about kilometers? These are, yeah, kilometers. So, do you know how much one kilometer is equivalent to? Do you know? Well, you should know it's already done this in standard five. Well, let's do a short revision. One kilometer is equivalent to a thousand meters. Now remember boys and girls, whenever you hear the word kilo, it yes means one thousand. All right, just like kilograms and it means one thousand grams. Right? Right then. Now one meter is a hundred centimeters. This is not new. And then we have one centimeter is 10 millimeters. 10 millimeters. Now look at this. We have 8 kilometers, which is 8 times 1,000 meters, which is 8,000 meters. And boys and girls, this is, yes, transferring or converting from kilometers to meters. Hence, 1 kilometer is 1,000 meters. So if you have 8 kilometers, you times it by 1,000 and you get 8,000 meters. Now, the next one. We have there 8 meters is 8 times 100 centimeters, 